Hello. Um, I know it's been a couple weeks. I had a video yesterday or last week, but it spent four days uploading on YouTube, so I figured just stop that and wait until Monday to record a new video. Um, the past few weeks have been crazy. There, we had the funeral service for my stepdad. We, I was in the hospital, and then I was finishing up work for school for um, this internship fair, and it, it was just, yeah, it was just a crazy week. I had my sister in town for one week for the service and then she left and my brother stayed for about another week and a few days so trying to juggle school work but still enjoying time with them and going out and doing things fun with them it was yeah it was difficult but Luckily, I don't think I got too stressed out. <laughs> um, yeah, but it was definitely a little stressful. Um, but in the end, I was able to oh, take a few breaths and get, uh, I think, all the work done that I needed to get done for my classes. And so now... There's just a few weeks left, and, um, yeah, so I, I feel like I've gotten back to a place where I can just take the homework assignments one class at a time and get them finished and then move on to the next one, get that finished, and I can keep at this rhythm until school is out for the summer um, and then I can hopefully pull my life together I feel like it's just gone completely out of control the last few months and I mean if you look just at my room I mean this screen is falling off, my bed's not made, and over here there's just all this stuff just on the ledge, and if you could only see the floor and my desk, it's, I have a little pathway to get here to my computer, and nothing obscuring the camera, but everywhere else it's just chaos, and that's what I've kind of felt the past few weeks is just complete chaos and I feel like now it's starting to calm down again and things are starting to fall back into a normal pattern, a normal um, schedule, which is good. Um, but yeah, things are going really well. I had a scan a few, a couple, maybe it's been two, three weeks ago. I've already forgotten. But that scan showed a couple tumors that they've been watching have shrunk by a couple centimeters. And that's just a huge miracle to me because the most that they've ever shrunk in the past have been maybe a few millimeters. And so to go from millimeters to a couple of centimeters is just crazy to me. And so I feel like this clinical trial is really working. And so far I haven't had really any side effects of the medication, which is really great. I've been on this medication IV combination for maybe 
maybe three months now, and I think that's probably the longest I've been on a medication, you know, constantly without having major side effects, and it's been really good. I'm still on this uh, CAD pump. It's my fanny pack that everyone loves that I wear. Um, but I'm not able to drive because it's such a heavy medication. It's dilated, And so right now, I'm, since school's coming to an end, and I don't really use this as much as I used to, so we're trying in the next week to turn off the constant drip of medication and just go to the button bolus when I need it and see how I do, along with uh, pain medication a patch um, so combined we're hoping that that will be able to allow me one to go down on this high-powered um, pain medication but also it'll hopefully let me start driving again which would be a huge relief to me and my mom just so that she doesn't have to worry about if she's going to drive me, if I'm going to get a ride, if I'm going to get an Uber. Yeah, it'll, I think, relieve a lot of stress in that area, but it'll also allow me to get back into hanging out with friends, get back to dating possibly, you know, just normal things, going over to a friend's house and just hanging out for a few hours, just, yeah, just being a little more independent again and seeing as how it's been probably a year I'd say I haven't driven for almost a year now it's been it's been hard on me personally just always having to have a driver or someone to take me places and I'm extremely grateful that I've been blessed with people to take me places, including my mom, you know, I just mean, it still will be nice to get back to not having to rely on a team of people to get me to school, get me to appointments, and things like that, so, um, Sorry about that, technical difficulties. Um, but yeah, I'm just really happy. I did kind of a little self-experiment sort of thing. And through natural means, uh, herbs and different things, I won't say exactly what it is, but um, if you private message me or something, I can explain to you more. But I actually had a tumor in my shoulder come up and out, and it's gone, and there's like a little you can't see it and I don't really want to show you but well I do but I don't think you would probably want to see it but the stuff that I was using um, 
soaked into the skin and left the healthy tissue alone and just caused the cancer cells, the tumor cells, to dry up but also to come up and out and just it came off like it was a it ended up being about the size of a nickel to a quarter size about um and yeah it stuck to the bandage and came off clean like it didn't bleed it didn't <sighs> Yeah, there was no extra dead skin or anything like that. It was, it's so healthy looking. And just to have that tumor out of my body is, the feeling is almost indescribable. Just to know that that will never never be back in my body, that that will never be something that I'll have to worry about again. I have other ones, obviously, but I'm just so grateful and blessed that I was led to this, and I do feel that I was led to this product to use it um but i am so excited about getting rid of this cancer now i i have almost zero doubts now that i will be able to beat it, that it will sooner rather than later honestly not be a part of my life anymore. And to feel that is so overwhelming. Um, it's so much joy and happiness that I haven't felt for, I can't remember ever feeling this much happiness, you know, that this is gone and out and that I can actually beat this cancer. It's rare, it's slow growing, doctors don't know what to do with it, but I feel like I found something and it worked. I mean, it worked. Like, there's no denying or questioning that it worked, because I saw it, I experienced it come up and out of my body and saw it there on the counter, just there, no longer having an opportunity to spread, to grow, to cause other problems, it's gone, it's out, and I'm just so grateful for being led to this product, and please if you do have a question about it, just message me. Um, I just don't want to say it and have it online because I don't want something to happen to that company just because they potentially have something that can help so many people, but I know that they could possibly, I don't know, I don't even want to vocalize it, but just ask me and I'll be glad to share more about it. 
Alright, that's all for this week, I think, but um, hopefully this one loads faster. Alright, bye.